Hi, today we're going to talk about the third Blue Wave uh, firmware update for the Samsung T10. Uh, next to that there we've got the uh, Samsung BS300 Bluetooth speaker. Um, now in the third Blue Wave firmware update on here, they added some things. Uh, like You know Samsung likes to give you a lot of stuff when you update. We've got three games. We've got uh, ten new GUI or um, graphic user interfaces. We've got a file deletion function on here now. Um, for the text viewer, we've got a landscaping view, and now we've got AAC file playback, and then uh, now we can add more bookmarks to video, which is really nice. Um, as you see on the display, Sammy's not here anymore. This is one of the new GUIs. There are ten in total, but um, you have to check those out for yourself. There's so many of them. You see, there's really nice-looking little graphics. They put a lot of time into this. It looks like. Uh, now, if you want to get the other GUIs, check out what they've got. Um, connect your T10 to your PC and then you can download the GUI files just like you did the firmware update uh, it's a little bit inconvenient but it's worth it uh, they're all free and as you can see I mean this one's really nice looking the other ones are all really great also and if you don't know how to do it um, check out my UCC it'll show you I uh, just run a search for the UCC as, uh, for the P2 firmware update and you'll be able to figure out how to do it there now let's take a look at the games on the uh, T10 Let's go down the list. This one's Bomb Bomb. This is like a falling puzzle game. I think we've all played pretty fun though. Let's get out of here, check one of the other games out. There we have Bubble Smile. I just gotta move these little faces around until they uh, match up and then fall. Now you pretty much get the point of that, I'm sure. Then we got Chicken Runway. This is Chicken down at the bottom. Try to avoid getting smashed by, oops, these balls and pick up little baby chickens and carry them with you. Oops, got hit. <laughs> Alright, so those are the games we've got on the uh, T10. With the new uh, Blue Wave firmware update, they added a file deletion function onto here, which is nice. You can go ahead and delete uh, files you don't want without having to go into, uh, without plugging it into your computer. You can do it right here on the, the T10. I'll show you how to do that. So we went in a file browser. Um, just pick something say I don't want that song anymore and go down to delete delete yes it's deleted now let's take a look at what they added to the text viewer under prime pack let's go to text pick your file let's see it's text viewer like we had it before we go ahead under our menus cycle down go to view type horizontal now we've got like a landscape uh, horizontal view mode for our text viewer so we got like a little bit longer we can read which is nice and they added some other really cool stuff to here too we can change the 
text viewer's color. Got the background and the text both changed, so you can go ahead and pick whatever is just easier on your eyes. Let's go with that. We also do font size. View type is where we could uh, go ahead and change from horizontal to normal. Then under language, if you've got something that's not in English, if it's not working, go under language and you can go ahead and change it to whatever language it is you're trying to read in. Alright, let's see it switch the color of my text. And we hold that down, it goes ahead and makes it full screen, so it's just even easier to read there. Let's head back out. So that's it for the text viewer. Now let's take a look and see what they changed the music on here. Go down albums. What they changed is um, now we can run AAC files on here, which is really nice. Um, all the songs I've got on the T10 right now I took from my iTunes uh, folder, so they're all AAC files. Um, let's take a listen to it real quick. As you hear, the sound quality is really good. Um, AACs sound a lot better than MP3s, so it's a nice uh, change they did to this. And this stuff supports up to uh, 256 kbps AAC, so you can download a lot of. You can put a lot of different kinds of songs on here. Uh, the only issue is right now with AAC, we can't uh, view album artwork as you can see down there, only with MP3s. Let's take a look at how you can add bookmarks on the uh, new firmware update. Now, before when you were looking at a or adding a bookmark, you'd only add one to one video and then it deleted whatever you had on the other videos. Let's fast forward on here to a point and then add a bookmark to it. There you go, add bookmark, and just delete the one I had already on this video. Let's go back, check out our other video. Fast forward a bit on here too, then add a bookmark. Alright, now let's go back to the first movie we had. And it starts playing from the beginning again. Um, but now if I go to bookmark, it jumps right to where I wanted it to go to. Uh, what's really nice about that, instead of deleting them for every other video when you add a bookmark, now we can add up to 100 bookmarks to 100 videos. So that's uh, really nice. And that's pretty much all we've got for the third firmware Blue Wave update on the T10. Until um, next time, bye.